Hey guys, Luke here, and uh, we're back for the third episode, I think, uh, of my Modico career. I'm going to go straight into it. Made a few more changes into the side, just rotating the side pretty much. Um, strong, really, it's really strong side, so we could have the luxury of doing that. Now, uh, what I want to talk about is, well, there's a line up there, you can see. You've got Cruz playing this game. Pretty much just to try and sort of get someone to buy him, to be honest. Um... I want to talk about like players like, for example, Falcao. I don't know if you probably haven't noticed because I haven't really shown, but he's gone down to an 87 rated. Now it's season, it's uh, year 2017, so um, he is getting older. I think he's about 31 or so. He's over 30, but like for him to go down that much. Um, it doesn't seem like a lot, but to start, he was up at like a 91, and like his pace has gone down, like, how often do you see players actually lose all their pace? It's not often, like, Eto is still as, just as fast now as what he was a few years ago, like, and he, he's, he's pretty old as well, so, I mean, I know it doesn't, like, what fits for one doesn't fit for all, but still, I find that uh, players tend to decrease decrease uh, too much. I hope this is um, four minute halves. I didn't even check. If it's not, that's not to worry. So we've got Cruz here on the ball. It's a good little ball. Balotelli goes close. Jeez. Two minutes FIFA time and we nearly score. So I think uh, Rafael's back in. Uh, we're playing Fernando. Like I said, we're playing Cruz. Uh, Valdez is playing this game. Um, Masaccio. I think he's from Villarreal. I shouldn't know who he is because I'm doing a Villarreal save on Football Manager, which uh, either I'm currently doing right now or I'm going to in the future um, on my channel. Show, like, pick off uh, for where I'm at. Oh, that's a good counter. No, it's not. Stopped the counter pretty well. Oh, we just got caught out of Contra. El Shari makes up for it. Oh, it wasn't supposed to go to him. It was supposed to go to uh, Fernando. Oh, I thought that tackle was going to be alright there. See, so, yeah, I was talking about how players decrease. Um, I'm not sure what Messi and all that. I'm not sure if they decrease. I think Ronaldo is starting to decrease. I think he's like 30 something on mine. Uh oh. Oh, I thought he might have been offside. Doesn't matter. If he's watching, probably was nowhere near to be an offside, and I look like an idiot, but it's a shit corner. And they still <laughs> nearly score. Wow. That was terrible. Oh, I thought I read it. Good stuff there, Cohen Trow. He's on the break. Put in an early cross. And it's a goal to Balotelli. Nice goal there. We did the early cross thing where you hold um, LT. I think that's what it is. I could just be sort of telling myself that and just doing normal crosses, but yeah, I think there's a, di there's a difference. It's a nice all goal there, nice finish. I'm not sure who the keeper is to the other side, but he stood no chance there. Bordeaux, I think, is the type of person, which if I haven't mentioned it. No, it's there. When I say I think, it was more of pronunciation. Oh, that was bad. That was bad. We went in for the tackle. Get, you press A early, gets in. Balotelli. Balotelli's here. Saved. I should have kept taking it in and then did the like cross face of goal shot. El Shirari tracking back. Didn't get it. Verratti. Oh, Colin Trout. That's a good tackle. Feeling my defence is a little bit more on song this game. A little bit more. Con I'm concentrating a lot more. Um, 
probably resulting in a not as good episode. Oh, Balotelli through. And they just, like, if that was a human playing, they would have been spamming the shit out of... Oh, what a miss by El Sharari. What a haircut, too. I know he's had a that sort of haircut for a little while, but I don't remember it being that much of like a mower. Yeah, I was saying, um, like if I'd been versing someone and that happened, they would have been spamming the cir well, circle or B button. For me, it's B. I don't know why circle popped into my head first. And time to counter. Good stuff there by Coutinho. I wish that um, that move was still overpowered, but it's not. Nothing we can do. And when I say overpowered, it's a um, thing where you could like press the two triggers in, and what would happen? Oh, he's on. But we're going to get caught. No, we don't. It's a goal for El Sharari. These ones go in way too often, I think. Um, yes, yeah, so it's the two triggers, then you sort of like do thing where it like stops, but you come out like as if you've got 99 acceleration. It's ridiculous. I scored for with goalkeepers doing that. It's probably a good thing that it's gone, but. I remember back, back in the height. I uh, didn't really have much of a height, but when um, I was more FIFA focused channel and like I'd first some of my subscribers, I remember I scored with the goalkeeper and he quit. By the way, I, think, I don't think I'll increase the difficulty throughout this career. The goal is I should be winning these games, so. Oh, he's off. Yep. I thought for a second he wasn't, but that was just because he wasn't involved with the play and then he got involved. So yeah, I think I will be doing a football manager one with uh, Villarreal. Oh, oh no. Who do we cover? That was a great save. It's kind of like I knew we had to cover one of them and then I realised as the corner's coming in I'm on Cohen Trow, who's like five foot nothing, and we would have no chance. Luckily, Valdez was up to the task. Valdez again. Oh, that might have been Coutinho that time. Uh oh. I really gotta fix that up. That part of my game is shit. And play it out to Balotelli. Coutinho through on goal. And they spam B once again. I thought that might have been a foul there. Um, from us, I should say. Like, I slid, I slid him after the ball, after the fact that he had passed. Um, a lot of the times, I, I get away with that sort of stuff. Like, generally, like, it's a pretty strong part of my game. I'm pretty good at timing, timing um, slide tackles and all that. But then when I get it wrong, I get it really wrong. Balotelli's on. Went for the Ronaldo chop. Probably should have just crossed it. I'm guessing that's half time. Now I'm not sure how long that's been. It feels it feels like it's a six minute game, so I might have to change it permanently to a four minute game instead of just doing it in the menus. Because I don't think I was in the menus that long. For the commentary to be going already nine minutes, but that's not to worry. It's a little bit, a little bit more um, entertainment for you, if you can call it entertainment. I, I would. No bias at all. Oh man, I thought we could just get that. We've, we've got like a really good counter-attacking side, except for Cruz, but he's got really good through balls and all that, so. Maybe maybe I might have to stick keep Cruz around, but in saying that, I've got Coutinho, so I've sort of got one too many. Mariano. 
because like even like for me to rotate squads, I still sort of got too many. That's why I'm trying to get rid of like I've got so many CDMs. I used to have no CDMs. That's why I was playing crews there. And now I've got a whole bunch of them. Crews outpace him. Oh, it's a nice save there. Um, I think one of the other episodes I was talking about Falcao scoring them. Very similar to these ones. Ones that really shouldn't be going in. Here's a goal. No. Nah. Uh, he's gone for a volley. Didn't even get a touch onto it. He's going to go for a finesse there. Oh, shit. They didn't pass it, thank God. We, I was so stuffed there. Nikon Trow gets back. Good stuff there by Cohen Trow. Oh, oh, that's a really good cross. Coutinho does enough to get it out of there. Held up by Balotelli. It's actually a really nice play up until then, where we lost the ball. Just holding up the ball, stopping. Instead of trying to counter attack every time, you just got to make a judgment on Sometimes you just need to stop it. Which is, in the games that I, that I dominate an ultimate team, in like online, when I dictate the tempo, that's when I usually win. It's usually when, I, when someone else plays a fast tempo and I just try to counter them every time. It's usually when it doesn't work. And there we got this the one two. Oh, should have scored there. We'll make a sub. I think it's about uh, 65 minutes in. Yeah, maybe maybe it is. Obviously for you, you just will understand after watching it. But it's really hard to tell. This half field like feels like it's gone really quick. There you see Falcao on 87. Lost a lot of his pace. He's got terrible at that really at the moment let's be honest I'm going to leave Cruz on we'll take off Balotelli and we'll bring on Royce that striker also I think we might might start playing Marshall actually we'll make another sub Marshall he's, he's got like 99 sprint speed like he's really good he's been at the club from the start so that's another sort of reason to keep him like not like play him I should say we could put Denny Alves on Right mid for Coutinho. That could work. Denny Alves is kind of like a right right winger anyways. He can do that, all that sort of stuff. I mean, he hasn't got the pace on here. I think he's like retiring at the end of the year for me. Because he's like 33 or some shit. There's a goal. There we go. There's that corner header that I, see, I get all the time on Ultimate Team. I'm not sure how far I'm going to be into my series on uh, Ultimate Team when this one goes up, but... Um, I think e even if you've only seen the first two episodes, which I've uploaded, um, I've only uploaded the first two episodes at the time of recording this. Um, but even then, I think scored a lot of uh, corner goals. Oh my god, how the hell did we not score that? That's atrocious. I'm sorry. Should be 4-0. Oh, Great tackle, Cruz. That was just supposed to be a step over, not that. I can't, I can't do it without holding the, the LT. It doesn't feel right. I'm going to have to start holding L, um, the left trigger. Anyways, like, I can't do it. I try to do it without holding the triggers because you don't have to do it anymore, but I just can't. Doesn't feel comfortable. I've got like a really weird, um, like, not chills, like, my body just like heated up for some reason, like, really randomly. And counter. I don't know why I did, did it in the air. Thank you. 
He's a goal. No, wow. That's two blown chances. I probably shouldn't have tried the finesse shot. That's Subasic. I think I think that's the dude who was in our team from like right at the start. I wish I'm on career mode. I know uh, it's good and all, but I wish that like scouting thing wasn't like as hard. Like I wish I could just search for like Ronaldo and stuff. Like if I search, if I put in a search for like cams or something, like all the best cams that come up, it wouldn't come up with like an alphabetical order list. Uh, that's another could have been goal. Probably having Fernando and uh, Ferrate uh, back, like in the CDMs, probably helped a lot with the defence. To like out and out CDMs, like Gundogan's not really a out and out CDM. He's probably more of an attacker, but he's so good. Ferrate's a midget, but not, nothing against him. But he's just really small. I didn't realise how small he actually was. I didn't even check his height or anything, I just got him. I think it starts off in like the 70s, so it's a pretty good increase. I'm hoping he goes up to like 90 or something, because he's still pretty young, he's like 84 rated. It's a good slide and tackle. Now this probably be one of our last attacking chances. Any others? Nice little ball. Wow. That looked like. <laughs> There's been in times if you've been watching my rugby league. Oh, that was a terrible touch from their centre back. My rugby league career, they did like a sort of glitch pass. That was like like a dummy half, like throwing pass, like a rugby pass for people who might not understand rugby league. It's just very similar to rugby. Union, but a little bit different, but like passing's same. Um, like they sort of like just pass up. That's what it seemed like with that last little chip from Verratti. So we went 3 0 against Bordeaux, I think. Pretty much domination. You see, we didn't have the possession, but we didn't need the possession. And it's quite ironic that Tony Cruz got man of the match. I might have to, I might just have to keep him. Maybe I didn't give him enough chance. Maybe it was Falcao not doing it for me, because. I don't know, I think I just I just need someone with a little bit of pace up front. A bit of a pace or to be honest. Not a bit. I'm, I am PSG our rivals a second. I think their team's gone downhill drastically like dramatically. Like I think I think they sold well they didn't sell but Ibrahimovic's really old now. He's gone down I think Cavani might have got sold to Man City. Man City I'm thinking. But uh, we'll just simulate up to here, just trying to get some people to go. This Mandoras dude, pretty good, he's Brazilian, Not worth 900,000, he's a pretty decent player. Um, he was my backup last season, but obviously I got De Gea now. He's, but like, I keep getting all these goalkeepers from the Youth Academy thing. I've stopped with the Youth Academy right now because I don't really need them. So, but yeah. Uh, Lucas Pearson. We'll loan him to Real Madrid. It's funny when Madrid's um, loaning people, and we certainly will not be selling a Denor. He's a really good player, scored a goal for us in that last game. So, I can't really think this team's like AJ, or I don't know how to pronounce it, but AJ something is the team that we're versing. Not AJ Lee, not the wrestler. Got a few more people, we'll get rid of him. I hope that these guys go on to become really good players. I wish there was a thing where I could um do like a football manager where I could be like oh, I have a buyback clause, like clauses, stuff like that. I reckon that'd be cool. Maybe they might start doing that. I'll talk about the next one. So just about there. So I'll wrap it up here. I'd like to thank you for watching. Um, really appreciate it when you leave like nice comments and all that. We've got a player sold there, ten thousand. We needed that. Um, yeah, so if you enjoyed the video, give it a like, and, um, no, hell no, we won't be selling Rodriguez. Um, yeah, leave a comment, give the video a like, and also, um, one thing, 
I haven't really mentioned before, but like ad block. If you got ad block on, turn it off for YouTube. Very much appreciate if you could do that. Um, helps benefits us like dramatically because uh, any money that I get from this um, will go back into the channel. So hel helps me out. Um, so yeah, like, subscribe, all that sort of stuff, and come back for the next one. Um, I think we'll reject this one. Well, we'll ask for more because I want to get. Mm, I want to accept it. I want to get rid of him. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Bye.